Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to our first module of Prompt Engineering course. Where in this video, we'll be discussing about some basics of Prompt Engineering and also uh, some of the prerequisites that you need to know before using Chat GPT or AI. So yeah, first of all, uh, I'll give you guys a bit of introduction about Prompt Engineering and Chat GPT, and also we will be seeing how you can use uh, Chat GPT on Open AI with you without any problem. So yeah, first of all, let's just see what is basically Prompt Engineering is. So Prompt Engineering is a uh, uh, actually the practice of designing precise prompts queries or instructions you can say to guide machine learning models and in that there's particularly a language models uh, in generating desired outputs. So basically this is a kind of a technique in which uh, you give prompts or commands to AI and it instruct that by using machine learning models and give you the desired or demanded outputs that you need. And it also involves fine tuning and refining prompts to shape the model's behavior and improve its performance for specific tasks. So yeah, moving forward well, let's just also see what is ChatGPT or OpenAI. ChatGPT is a language model that is developed by OpenAI and it is based on GPT which is generative pre-trained transformer architecture and designed to engage in conversational interactions and also uh, ChatGPT can generate human-like responses to prompts and has been trained on a diverse range of internet texts to provide useful and contextually relevant information. So it is basically a language model that is actually developed by OpenAI and it uses a GPT architecture and that is actually designed to get human-like conversations and you know it basically works the same. Uh, you, you need to give it to command and prompts to that and it will process all that and give you the desired or specific output that you need by using AI. All right, so yeah, now we'll see how you can integrate or install chat GPT in your system and how you can, you know, start using that right away. So, so let's just see that. All right, so first of all, what you need to do is you need to go to your browser and you need to search chat GPT and you need to click on this open AI link and after that this kind of an interface will appear on your screen you need to click on try GPT right here and as soon as you hit that it will give you two options either you want to log in or sign up so obviously if you if you're using it for the first time you need to sign up for that course you need to click on sign up option and then it will ask you to create your account if you want you want you can create your account with Google with Microsoft account or even your Apple iPhone ID like this totally up to you with my case I'm gonna create my account with Google so I'm gonna continue with Google okay then it will ask you to enter your Gmail ID I'm gonna enter that and obviously before that it will ask you for your Gmail password but my Gmail ID was already to my Chrome account so it didn't ask password for me uh, then after that it will ask you for your first and last name and your birth date you can enter that as well and it will ask you now for your phone number you need to enter that and verify that as well send code via sms and yeah then after that it will give you a six digit code into your phone so you're gonna copy that and paste it right here okay yeah so as you guys can see it's just showing you like our account has been created just gonna hit next and it will just uh tell you some information about chat gpt you're gonna hit next and uh, hit done and yeah that will be quite a bit of interface of chat gpt first of all you can see your account information at the left bottom corner and then you can see your account details into that you can log out as well you can go to settings and you know you can select theme from a uh, light dark or anything you want and have the option of new chat and uh, if you want you can upgrade that to plus as well that's of your choice so yeah now you're good to go let me just type any prompt here and see if that's working for us or not so i'm just gonna type here what is prompt engineering all right yeah so as you guys can see it's working as a charm and you know with every prompt or every chat you're gonna give to chat gpt is gonna be saved with you all that data will be saved with you on this bar right here yeah so you don't have to worry about losing any of your data or stuff in chat gpt it will automatically save you uh in your history so yeah actually that was it for uh today's video i hope you liked it in this video i told you guys about a little bit brief introduction about prompt engineering and uh, chat gpt or open AI. AI. and i also told you guys how you can basically install and set up chat gpt in your system and how you can make that run right away so yeah that will be it for today's video i hope you guys liked it and i'll see you in the next video take care bye bye